This tutorial will show you how to integrate Chatterware's Now We're Talking with the dialog system for Unity. The Now We're Talking asset provides lip sync for low poly characters that don't have mouths as part of their models. We'll start with a project in which we've imported the dialog system, Now We're Talking, and Cinti Studio's Polygon Pirates pack. If you don't have the Polygon Pirates pack, that's fine. The process is the same for any art asset. First, import the Dialog Systems NWT support package, which you can find in the Dialog Systems third party support folder. Now, let's play the integrations example scene to get an idea of what NWT looks like. Ha <laughs> ha where's the rum? Arr! Arr! We'll set up something similar with the Polygon Pirates pack. I've opened up a copy of the Pirates Pack demo scene in which I've added the Pirate Captain and configured it with Now We're Talking according to the Now We're Talking Quick Start video. Briefly, this just entails adding the Now We're Talking prefab to the model's head. The only difference from the Quick Start is that we haven't added any NPC phases yet. Next, we'll tie in the dialog system. Add a dialog manager game object and create a dialog database. Let's create an actor for the pirate. And now we'll create a conversation for him. We'll use the audio clips included in Now We're Talking's demo, so we'll write the dialog text to fit that. There are two ways to edit dialog text. You can edit the dialog text field in the inspector, or you can double click on a node to edit it right in the canvas. We'll make this a back and forth conversation between the pirate captain and the player. Next, let's configure the conversation to play some animations when the pirate delivers his lines. To learn how to play animations, please see the cutscene sequence tutorials. Now we need to prepare the pirate's NWT object for use with the dialogue system. First, we'll export a voiceover script to get a list of the entry tags associated with each line of dialogue. In the Database section, expand Export Database. Change the format to voiceover script. You can untick everything except for conversations. We'll use the default entry tag format. Then export this to a CSV spreadsheet. In practice, You'll open this file in a spreadsheet application and use it to name your audio clips and keep track of which ones have been recorded. For now, we'll just examine the file in the inspector view and note the entry tags of the pirate's lines. Now find the pirate's Now We're Talking game object. Now 
and add phases corresponding to the entry tags. Then assign the audio clips that correspond to those lines. We need to tell the dialog system to play those phases, so we'll use the new NWT sequencer command included in the integration. Add the NWT command to the Dialog Manager's default cutscene and tell it to play the phase corresponding to the current line's entry tag. With the NWT command, you can specify a subject as the second parameter and the optional keyword no wait, all one word, as a third parameter if you don't want the sequence to wait for the phase's audio clip to finish. If you omit the subject, it'll use the current speaker. Finally, we'll add a trigger to start the conversation. And let's also assign the letterbox dialog UI to get some variety from the basic standard UI. So we can see that the conversation goes back and forth between the pirate and the player, it plays the animation states that we specified, and it uses Now We're Talking to play the audio. And that's it for the Now We're Talking integration. It's simple to set up and very effective for these low-poly style characters.